yeah. Guess this is episode five. And obviously, the reason why I'm in pretty much a somber mood. Obviously, the result yesterday Arsenal lost to Olympiakos. Frustrating and devastating, to be honest. I woke up this morning and I was just in a downward state, to be honest, because. I thought to myself, how did we allow this to happen? We capitulated, we were awful, we were bad. But the worst thing about it is we didn't show any fight. Like, we got caught out too many times. Too many times we, we were slack. Midfield were just all over the place. Defensively, I don't know what at times we were doing. Mustafi was one of our best players on the field. But when I look at it from an angle, we deserve to go out because we weren't good enough. But the aftermath is I'm still feeling the effects of how poor we were. We just did not turn up at the Emirates as well. Of all places, you want us to turn up to show some fight, to show some passion, to show some desire. We didn't turn up. Absolutely shambolic. Do you know what I mean? But just the fact that we could have had that last minute goal and we didn't score it was a bit devastating as well. I'm not going to blame Aubameyang for that. I just think overall as a whole, defensively we made errors. And you've got to look at the mistake from, you know, the goalkeeper. Why would you not just clear your lines and get rid of that ball? Why would you hold on to that ball and then put it out for a corner, which then leads to their goal? Do you know what I'm saying? And I know rival fans are going to be bad. Ah, yeah, Arsenal fan TV and chill. Okay, whatever. You can have your moment. Have your moment. Your moment is right now. But then when it's time for, for you guys, when you guys fall and capitulate, just be ready and be there. Said, well, one good turn deserves another. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of it all, we will take our L. Yes, we lost today. We were awful. We were bad. And, you know, we're the banter club as everybody puts it down to be. Do you know what I mean? But as I said, Arteta is doing good things for us. For me, I feel he made crucial mistakes where he did not take Ozil off. Ozil should have come off. I don't think Ozil was a bit of a passenger. Joss Abbas as well should have come off as well a lot sooner. Do you know what I mean? For me, those two were, you know, quite non-existent in the game. And then you also had... At the back of there, Bellerin as well, who had one of his worst games since he's come back. But he hasn't been on form since he's come back. So it's just been one of those cases where maitland Nash should have started. You know what I mean? We should have also had played uh, Martinelli instead of Lacazette. Do you know what I mean? Because if we did, we may have more chances to have scored. Obviously, I'm a little bit peed off because I thought, you know, Olympiakos... We could have scored. After Bamiang scored the overhead kick, I was, you know, really in my feelings, thought we may actually do this. And then we go and do it in typical Arsenal style. Typical of us, isn't it? Always typical of Arsenal to go and do something good and then fail at the last minute. This is just us, isn't it? But everybody's going to be like, ah, ha, 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 Arsenal FC Banter Club back again. Yes, whatever. She'll have your moment, as I said. But we will be back. Arteta is doing good things for us. And yeah, and obviously today was a blimp in form. But remember, he's he's won the previous 10 games before this one. So, you know what I mean? He's been on a good run of form. I'm not going to get into the team. I'm going to lay them down. But certain things should have changed. And certain things should have changed during the period when certain players weren't turning up. And that's all I've got to say about that. Do you know what I mean? But I'm really gutted to have gone out. I would have preferred us to have gone out in the semis. Or, you know... And I predicted we'll probably get to the quarters of the semis and it seems like that prediction was completely wrong. But whatever in it, it, we go again, you know, we've got the league, I guess, to construct. But I, even I don't think we're going to make top four. So it's just like, what is the point? So we just wait and see, I guess. But yeah, it is what it is. Ugh.